Hello friends, subscribe technology and press the bell button to regular updates. Hey what's up guys, welcome back to my channel technology and I'm fine. I hope you guys will also doing well and on my last video I was showing you how to dual boot with Windows 7 and Ubuntu and uh, I know few people are following that video and install Ubuntu and Windows 7 uh, on, on their computer but a uh, few people are asking me about one question that is uh, how to remove Ubuntu after dual boot so without any formatting so in this video I'm going to show you that so you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe my channel because it's really encourage me and motivate me to make more videos like this and as well as you will get a notification on your mobile so please do subscribe guys it's free <laughs> open your computer you need to download uh, one software on your computer it's called a uh, easy bcd okay so you need to download this software is a very useful software and it, it is freely available on the internet and a few people are asked me about this easy bcd is not free but i i must tell them uh, these are free so uh, free software you have to register on easy bcd to download from easy bcd website as well as you can download from any other alternative website so i will give you all the link to my video description you can download it from there okay so after download this easy vcd on your computer you have to install this application on your computer okay so click on uh, yes and as you can see it's showing it's already installed on my computer okay so as you can see the easy vcd is already installed so these are uh, please click ok to remove the previous version so i am not going to remove i'm just click on cancel and i'm going now going to the start menu and type there easy bcd okay sorry easy bcd yes this one you need to download and install and after that you have to open this easy vcd on your computer so now we have to wait okay uh, so now what you have to do here is my easy vcd uh, software is uh, you need to click on edit boot menu just a minute So you need to click on this BCD backup repair, okay? So you need to click on there, BCD backup repair. And after that, you need to click on this recreate and repair boot files, okay? So after that, you need to click on this perform action. So click on there. And now you have to wait for some time. So it's done. So now click on this edit boot menu and as you can see here is showing windows 7 so now i am going to restart my computer okay so now as you can see the ubuntu uh, at windows 7 dual boot uh, booting system is automatically gone from my uh, boot menu as you can see it's directly started windows 7 on my computer so through that process you can remove windows uh, uh, ubuntu from dual boot so now i am going to show you how to delete that drive on your computer so first you need to uh, log in with your username so after reboot your computer you need to uh, go to your start menu and after that uh, right click on your my computer and click on this manage tab okay and after that you need to click on this uh, disk management tool which is showing on there click on there this disk management tool okay sorry this disk management tool uh, i was click on drive di uh, device manage manager so now what you have to do, you need to uh, delete that Ubuntu uh, partition from your computer. So for that you need to 
find that partition i will show you so here is my ubuntu partition this one it is g drive so this is the uh, uh, 57 gb let me check yes this one this one is a ubuntu partition okay so you need to uh, delete this volume from here and after that you can uh, expand your uh, volume from there or you can create a new simple volume also so i hope this video will really helpful for you and please don't forget to click on that subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or question then comments below i will give you all the answer of of your questions so see you on next video next time take care